G'day everyone, my name's Adrian and I'm the lead author for the geography component of this series. And I'm here today to talk to you about how the series can be used to help students develop geographical skills for about year seven through to year 10. So firstly, I'll pose a question to you and, and that is what is the best way to teach geographical skills? In my opinion, a really important thing is to expose students to a range of different data types and different analysis skills throughout each year level and to make sure there's a balance in these skills between hands-on, things like traditional forms of, of map analysis, but also the use of, of spatial technology to assist with that. Data and the skills need to be relevant to the topics being studied. This helps students to understand both the skills, but also um, the content. And these skills should increase in complexity as students develop from year seven through to year 10. Also highly recommend that, that scaffolding should be included where appropriate to support students who may have some difficulties with some of the skills. And a really important point is not to just teach skills for the sake of teaching skills. This makes geography incredibly boring and unnecessary. The whole point here is the skills should help us to understand the content. So they should be applied where the content is and presented in text, as opposed to some other textbooks where they have a geographer's toolkit chapter that often tempts some teachers to run a, a one or two week skills um, unit. It's completely unnecessary as long as the skills are actually embedded in, in the topics, which is what we've done in this series.